What is up, everyone? Welcome to another episode of Midget Games here. We are here with Destiny, and we are on the episode The Walls Come Down. This is from the last episode we did, which run over it really quick with you guys. King of the Mountain. So, um, yeah. <laughs> Lord Saladin called you to defend the abandoned mountain top, so we did that already. Now we're on to the Cosmodrome has once been transformed by an ancient threat. Find the source of the corruption. And so this is getting exciting because I really, uh, I'm just excited, to be honest with you guys. Um, that's basically year three now, technically, Destiny. I don't like how, like, Lord Saladin, this is technically this, the second major expansion. In the Vanguard database. That's because I went to great lengths to lock it away. The records are in the Iron Temple. Okay, but if the Fallen already know about Siva, then shouldn't we? What you need to do now is track Septix. If we find him, we will know the extent of the corruption. Alright, sounds good. So, <clears throat> basically the records about the Iron Lords are all kept away in the temple. And something, basically, I think they believe is the devils are trying to get in. Okay, I don't know which scares me more. The giant catch, or whatever took a bite out of the wall. Guardian, it's Shiro. You're gonna need some cover. Make for the Cosmodrome. Ooh, some good ammo there. I'll take all the ammo I can get. There we go. Alright, let's see. Alright, we're done here. Let's go inside. It's cold, it's winter. Let's go inside. Back at the Cosmodrome yet again. Kells gone. Getting a force this large to work together is almost impossible. Saladin, you mentioned a sensor grid. Can we use that to tell how far this occupation extends? The fallen are irrelevant, Shiro. The only thing that matters now is finding Sepix. Alright, so the fallen one's breaking in here. So where do we need to go? Down looks like? Alright. Okay. Alright. <clears throat> Let's see. Can we hide? There we go. Come on, really? There you go. Ah, the snow is dragging me. Getting some... I, I, I tell there's resistance. I'm not... There we go. <clears throat> Fuck you go. Oh, okay. So you're somewhere up there, buddy. Gotcha. 
Alright, let's switch back up here. Let's get into this place and get going. <clears throat> I took care of most of it there. Nope. All right, gotta go this way. <clears throat> Pretty easy for the most part. All right, let's go in. There, Shank. care of most of those guys. Alright, there's another guy. <clears throat> Alright, looks like we need to go in here. Alright, back in the fans room. But still no sign of Sepix. that pattern over there. Can we take a closer look? Hmm. Let's see what this is. <clears throat> That's interesting. I'm picking up some strange readings. It's like what was on Sepix, but if I didn't know any better, I'd say this stuff is consuming everything around it. That is Siva. With the proper direction, it could create anything a civilization would need. Huh. At least in theory. Alright. Hive? The hive tend to keep to the dark. Something is driving them into the open. Fuck, I hate the wizards. <clears throat> Man, they're they're aggressive. Where the fuck did that wizard go? Boom, boom, miss. God damn it! Come on out, wizard. I get up here. Nope. Oh, Alright. So I gotta go around. Alright. I hate wizards. I hate them. They're the bane of my existence half the time. Okay. Don't need to pick up the green thing. All right, Acolyte. So Hive and Fallen are both coming out. This is interesting. Really set some stuff up then and see. Eh. Fuck it. All right, let's keep going. 
Actually, let's go ahead and we'll switch up a weapon here. I don't think I need it's a different rocket launcher. Get rid of those. Oh, yeah, let's equip the sword for now. <clears throat> I don't foresee using a rocket launcher. Usually I don't use them unless it's a really a big boss or something that just can't reach with a sword at all, like anything close to mid-range. Something I can't hit with my sniper rifle or have enough ammo for my sniper rifle. more of that stuff. Whoa, hello. Alright, one wizard, that's fine. There we go. Jesus Christ. It does more shoe numbers than they're aggressive. And it's taking me quite a bit of time to do this. All readings from the sensor grid. There's a monitoring station near your location. Hook into it and try to get the grid back online. No problem. There's a monitoring station. Let's get in there and let's turn this puppy back to the way it was. Bonner off. Doesn't matter. There's not enough left of the sensor grid to fix. Whoops. Wait, we can pull the logs from the monitoring station. Would that be enough to figure out what these fallen are up to? Do it. Something weird incoming. Fallen are different. They're augmented with some sort of technology, like sepics. Augmented or not, we need that sensor data. I don't think I'd like to know an improved fallen. Okay, we're doing okay here. Alright, that's why you get it. You take the sword here. <clears throat> That's why I like the sword. There we go. Takes care of that. And that takes care of that. <clears throat> Alright. Got everything I could out of the sensor logs. Speak to Lord Salad and Iron Temple. We still have to deal with Sepix. Alrighty. I've seen enough to know the fallen have restarted production of Siva. Guardian. We've established a base at the Iron Temple. Join us here. Alright, so we got a base at the Iron Temple, and uh, the Fallen are wanting to do something with the technology here. So that does it for this episode, folks. 
Um, if you want to see more crate content, please do subscribe today. If you do like the video, please do slap a like on it. As always, well, let's see what we get here first. 320 and 320. As always, guys, keep on gaming, keep on having fun, and let's play.